<laughs> Nicely done. In level 11, you completed hard and soft C and G. Yeah. Syllable division. Spelling rules one. Synonyms and antonyms. And text connections one. Yeah. Hello everyone. My name is Ashan Rashid. My name is Mufuz. And on today's episode, Mufuz will be completing level eleven. Well, let's get started. But before we get started, just in case you guys are new to my channel, my name is Ashan Rashid, and this is my my brother Mufuz. So yeah, so Mufuz, what will you be doing here? Completing up to four five Yes, good job. So why don't we go ahead and get started, everyone? That's all we have for today. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and click the bell to get more videos. Bye! We'll see you on the next episode! Now we will get started in the beginning. So, Mufu, what is level 11 called? Good job. So, what are the things you can see and do here? Yeah, so let's get started. What do you do while hanging upside down? The Eurasian blue chickadee has the special ability to hang upside down from a branch when looking for food. Cool. Cool. You've practiced finding the vowel sounds in longer words. When you see two consonants between the vowels, divide the word between the two consonants. Watch first. Fan. Tass. Tick. Fantastic. Try that with this word. K. Mo. K. Mo is not a real word. Sometimes the consonant goes with the first vowel. Try that Some with this word. Here says the syllables now say cam, cam L. Oh, cam this word is camel. This is a real word. Divide the word into syllables. Then press this button. So over here, in vowel O. N. Vowel. Oh, and the sheep is going down. Comical. How do you know these don't divide? Come. I know. Ick. Mm -hmm. Ow. Yeah. Comical. Great. Lamb. Lamb on. A. Lamb. A lamb, 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 a Turn. Project. Project. Turn. Project. Turn. Projector. 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 Tell. 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 And time, round time. 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 Round 
Ball, 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 on tier, ball on tier. I thought ball. it was ball on tier, but it was ball on tier. Ball, ball on tier, ball on tier. Or Dan, or Dan, or Dan, or Dan. Dan. Eyes. Organize. 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 I saw. He's already practiced know finding the vowel sounds in longer words. When you see two consonants between the vowels, divide the word between the two consonants. Watch first. Fan. 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 Fantastic. Try that with this word. K. Mo. K. Mo is not a real word. Sometimes the consonant goes with the first vowel. Try that with this word. The syllables now say cam o. Oh, this word is camel. This is a real word. Divide the word into syllables. Then press this button. Then press that button. I'm a projector. Pro. Jack, turn, projector. Ted, talented. And in now in that. Again. It's okay. Or, or, Dan, or, Dan, eyes, or Dan, or Dan, eyes, or Dan, eyes, Dan, cow, and cow, and cow, and cow, and cow, and cow, and oh, no, I'm done with it. Calendar. Nicely done. 
In level 11, you completed hard and soft C and G. Okay. Syllable division, spelling rules one, synonyms and antonyms, and text connections one. Yeah. Level 12, a Russian circus. Some Russian circus is a new sound. The Russian circus is known for featuring bears as a main act. These bears are taught to juggle and do acrobatics. Yeah, the pink do that right. The Matryoshka doll is a set of wooden dolls where one is placed inside the other. Over time, the Matryoshka doll has become a symbol of Russia and its culture. Let's Ladies and gentlemen, yes. boys and girls, children of all ages, oh, yes. is the traditional line at most circuses given by the ringmaster. Wow. In Russia, the circus is thought of as an art form on par with the theater or opera and has played an important role in Russia's cultural traditions. In Russia, the circus is thought of as an art form on par with the theater or opera and has played an important role in Russia's cultural traditions. Ladies and gentlemen, Ready, boys please. and girls, children of all ages, is the traditional line at most circuses given by the ringmaster. The Russian circus is known for featuring bears as a main act. These bears are taught to juggle and do acrobatics. The Matryoshka doll is a set of wooden dolls where one is placed inside the other. Over time, the Matryoshka doll has become a symbol of Russia and its culture. Nouns can be either singular, meaning one, or plural, meaning more than one. Plural nouns usually end in S, yes. but these are different. They are irregular. The word mice thank you, thank you, is thank the you, irregular thank you. plural form of the word mouse. Choose the correct plural Good form job. of the word you, you see. Level. Somebody asked me, what level are you, my food? And I didn't answer him. That's all we have, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for being at the Global Mindset University. So, that's what it looks like. Level 11, we just completed. Congratulations, Matthews. On the next episode, we're going to go ahead and continue working on the level 12. So, this level 12 is really, really cool. It's about the Russian circus. We'll go ahead and learn a lot of things while we're exploring the level 12. So, that's all we have for today. Don't forget to... Like, comment, and subscribe to the Global Mindset University. That was me, Muhammad Rashid Kamal. And me, Muhammad Rashid Kamal. And Ashari Rashid. Hey, so, you know where you can find us, right? If you would like to learn some of the things. That's all we have for today. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and click the bell to get more videos. Bye! We'll see you on the next episode. today don't forget to like comment share subscribe and click the bell to get more videos bye we'll see you on the next episode
buttons and antonyms, and text connections 1. Yeah. Level 12. Level 12. A Russian circus. Russian The Russian circus is known for featuring bears as a main act. These bears are taught to juggle and do acrobatics. Yeah, the bear can do that. Yes. The Matryoshka doll is a set of wooden dolls where one is placed inside the other. Over time, the Matryoshka doll has become a symbol of Russia and its culture. Looks Ladies and gentlemen, yes. boys and girls, children of all ages, all ages is the traditional line at most circuses given by the ringmaster. Wow, ringmaster. In Russia, the circus is thought of as an art form on par with the theater or opera and has played an important role in Russia's cultural traditions. In Russia, the circus is thought of as an art form on par with the theater or opera and has played an important role in Russia's cultural traditions. Ladies and gentlemen, Ladies boys and, and girls, children of all ages, is the traditional line at most circuses given by the ringmaster. The Russian circus is known for featuring bears as a main act. These bears are taught to juggle and do acrobatics. The Matryoshka doll is a set of wooden dolls where one is placed inside the other. Over time, the Matryoshka doll has become a symbol of Russia and its culture. The first one. Yes. Right. Nouns can be either singular, meaning one, or plural, no, no, meaning no. more than one. Plural nouns usually end in S, S, but these are different. They are irregular. The word mice. 